It's a true, <laughs> true perspective. Let's go over what makes this car so safe. First things first is the bulletproof windows that are this thick. The car is also encased in explosive proof armor that we're going to put to the test later on. Carl, do you want to press the button? Uh, so bad. You want to hit the smoke screen button? Please. We have a literal smoke screen. Oh my gosh, it smells. <laughs> but the best part is none of these features are what make the car really safe. It's the literal explosive proof frame around the car. And we're going to be the first people to test. And for reference, before we blow up the $300,000 car, we're going to blow up a normal car to see if the passengers survive. Three, two, one! Not only is it on fire, but the mannequins literally flew out of the car. It blew a sunroof into that thing. It doesn't handle it well at all. And before we blow up this car, I'm gonna put festivals inside of it. Better protect my freaking chocolate. So supposedly this car is explosion proof, but that's never been tested. Let's see if the mannequins and even more importantly, the festivals survive. Three, two, one. The car actually survived the blast with only a few minor scrapes. It put a dent in the window. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where are the Feastables? Chandler, get out the way. Chandler, the Feastables survived. 